Ripple gains new allies against the SEC, improving XRP price forecast. The San Francisco-based company's sympathizers in the legal battle with the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission, or SEC, grew last week, which raised the possibility that the XRP would finally get traction. Other development has been made in the protracted legal dispute involving the American Securities and Exchange Commission, or SEC, and the San Francisco-based fintech company, Ripple. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel, a channel where we give you the daily updates about XRP. In today's video, you will learn about the improvement in XRP price as Ripple gains new allies against the SEC. Watch the video till the end to see what we have for you. So without further delay, let's start our video. XRP is a digital asset with a $23.8 billion market valuation. With an estimated daily trading volume of $1.1 billion, XRP is ranked as the sixth largest cryptocurrency globally. It is currently available for 47 cents. The price has changed by negative 3.24% in the last 24 hours. In circulation are 50,215,300,844 coins. The rating for liquidity is 81.07. The B in crypto community has a 51.794 rating for cryptocurrencies. The dedicated Twitter account is followed by 2.6 million people. Legal experts in the field of cryptocurrencies have said that the SEC may be in for a bruising defeat in its case against Ripple. If the SEC were to lose, it may not be able to supervise the regulation of the crypto asset market. This would be a significant victory for American business and innovation. Rosalind Layden, a senior analyst, stated to Forbes on October 30th that if that's how it ends, it will have been a self-inflicted disaster from the start. Since both parties objected to the other's petition for summary judgment, the SEC and Ripple dispute, which has been ongoing since December 2020, is less likely to be resolved anytime soon. The SEC also requested an extension of the response date after new parties submitted amicus curiae briefs to the litigation. There are currently 12 organizations sponsoring Ripple. The most recent two are a Wyoming-based decentralized autonomous organization called VeryDAO and the publicly traded cryptocurrency exchange Coinbase. Even coin influencer BitBoy, who previously slammed the XRP community, is now attempting to participate. He just published screen captures demonstrating his application for the Director of Strategy and Operations position at Ripple Labs. Even referred to himself as the supreme leader of the XRP army, he claimed to have changed his mind regarding the neighborhood. The SEC, though, doesn't appear to be willing to drop the lawsuit. Many Ripple advocates think that the regulator's request for an extension is just another stalling tactic. Ripple strikes back. In December 2020, the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission took enforcement action against Ripple and two top executives. The SEC charged Ripple with selling its XRP coin in an unregistered securities transaction. Ripple CEO Brad Garlinghouse referred to the SEC's refusal to provide important information as shameful earlier this month. Holders of Ripple and XRP have been retaliating for almost two years, and their argument is getting stronger. In support of Ripple, over 75,000 XRP investors have filed amicus papers. Judge Torres, who is presiding over the case, must forget her first year of law school, according to attorney Jeremy Hogan, in order for the SEC to prevail. Other well-known legal professionals also concur that Ripple is headed towards success. These people include Professor J.W. Vera of the Scalia School of Law at Georgia Mason University and Kurt Levy of the Federalist Society, overturning the Howey test. The U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission may file an appeal with the Supreme Court, according to Vera but it will probably be unsuccessful. This might entirely invalidate or do away with the Howey test classification of cryptos. This criteria has been used by the SEC Chair Gary Gensler to claim that cryptocurrency assets are securities. What constitutes an investment contract and consequently a security is determined by the Howey test, which was established in 1946. An investment of money in a common enterprise with a reasonable expectation of profit to be derived from the efforts of others is what the contract is characterized as. If the SEC rules that XRP is not a security, Ripple has already committed to settling the matter and paying a fine. Gensler appears adamant to carry on battling even though it is a losing cause though. A victory for Ripple would not only result in a rise in the value of its tokens, but it would also create a precedent that stops the SEC from incorrectly classifying cryptocurrencies as securities and taking enforcement action. Ripple XRP whales in work Several interested parties are closing following the case in the meanwhile. The likelihood of Ripple succeeding has increased, and in recent days, XRP whales have traded more tokens. According to recent data, on October 29th, 
Bitstamp sent 40,614,705 XRP, worth $19.29 million, to an unidentified wallet. At the same moment, Bitstamp received a transfer from another wallet for 30 million XRP, totaling 14.25 million. The identity of the owner of the two wallets is unclear. The number of wallets holding 1 million to 10 million XRP has also surged over the past few days, indicating that whales may be preparing for the outcome of the lawsuit. Whales typically invest at times of low volatility, when an asset is on sale, and when they anticipate a large price increase in the near future. Since May, the holdings for this group have increased dramatically. XRP Price Movement Even though XRP has increased 4.6% over the past week, it is still trading within the range. However, there are a number of upbeat forecasts for its performance in the upcoming weeks and months, particularly now that it has surpassed the 200-day moving average. According to data from analytics company Santiment, the age-consumed measure indicated that around 11 billion XRP were moved. Spikes in the indicator indicated a significant number of tokens transferring after being inactive for a long time. It is currently trading at 49 cents and may predict that it will soon surpass the 50 cent threshold. Even so, the price would be more than 80% below the record high of $3.40. The next significant resistance level for XRP price could be at 50 cents and 60 cents in the event of a positive breakout, assuming that Ripple News improves and the bearish thesis is disproved. Utilizing the same strategy with a few modifications. In its legal battle with the SEC, Ripple Labs continues to attract more and more supporters. With the filing of an amicus curiae brief, more than 75,000 people and as of right now, 12 organizations have shown their support for Ripple. This assists the court in obtaining pertinent information or expertise from people or entities that are not parties to the case directly. Very DAO, a Wyoming-based decentralized autonomous organization, recently submitted an amicus brief in favor of the petition for summary judgment made by Ripple's counsel. However, the SEC isn't quite ready to give up yet. On November 4th, renowned lawyer James K. Fillon tweeted additional information about this development. The SEC has submitted a motion to extend the deadline for submitting all parties' reply papers to November 30th, 2022. They have also asked for a deadline for briefs with a larger page limit. According to the increased deadlines, the SEC requested that Annalisa Torres, the court's chief judge, direct that any additional amicus briefs be filed by November 11th, 2022. This development received no opposition from the other side. With the permission of the defendants, the SEC seeks that the court require that any further amicus motion be submitted no later than November 11, 2022, in order to avoid the necessity for further extension petitions. The motion had already been extended by the SEC. Maybe it needed more time to recuperate. The Hinman documents were released by the SEC toward the end of October. This decision was viewed as a huge win by the Ripple team and fans. Stuart Alderati, general counsel at Ripple, and Brad Garlinghouse, CEO, both posted a narrative on Twitter. Alderati criticized the SEC's attitude and strategies, saying that the regulators blindly bulldoze on despite numerous delays in the decision. XRP Price Prediction 2022 In its battle with the SEC, Ripple appears to be in a strong position and may succeed. By the end of December 2022, the Finders panel predicts that the price of XRP will have increased from its current 53 cent price to as high as 90 cents. If XRP wins the lawsuit, the panel predicts that by the end of 2025, the value of XRP will reach $3.81. Since our previous poll, our panel's forecast for XRP's future performance have decreased. If XRP prevails in the lawsuit, our panel's average prediction from back in April stated that XRP will be valued at $2.55 by the end of 2022. The typical XRP price forecast for December 2022 was $0.90 cents in October. TraderCobb.com's Craig Cobb is one of the panelists who is more upbeat. If XRP wins the lawsuit, he anticipates XRP trading at $1 by the end of 2022. XRP Price Prediction by 2025 Experts from the industry are gathered on the Finder panel. They frequently release price forecasts for the most popular cryptocurrencies. They recently underwent a poll regarding XRP price. Who cares if Ripple prevails in the court? By the end of 2025, the panel predicts that the price of XRP might reach $3.81. Martin Fowler, the CEO of Morpher, thinks it's time to buy, because of the huge win for the entire crypto industry if Ripple prevails. If XRP prevails in the legal battle with the SEC, Fowler's upbeat price forecast has it at $5 by 2025. So guys, this is it for today's video. I hope it could be a big help to you. What do you think about the XRP price improvement in the future? Share your views in the comments down below and get people involved in the discussion. Also, like and share our videos within your circle to make it reach out to everyone.
If you are new here, then don't forget to subscribe to our channel to get our daily videos. And for the notification of our daily videos, don't forget to click the bell icon and participate in the giveaway. And thanks for watching. We will come up with new videos, so stay tuned with us. And until then, goodbye, have a nice day.